Day four in Colorado, kicking with the homies. Woo! Homies, that's right. At Copper Mountain, um, I got the gotcha run in. Um, the Apple Watch is a cash, getting some steps. I got 0.1 uh, kilometers on my 10K eggs. And we're gonna see how much they hatch on a day of snowboarding. It's around like almost nine o'clock. About to do the thing. Super excited to be in Colorado right now. Good times. Day four, let's go get it. Oh. Whew. Colorado, you beautiful. Definitely a trip to remember. One tough thing though is uh, we're at elevation and it's getting like, you know, a maroon five harder to breathe, you know? But, you know, we're almost at 12,000 feet and, you know, Gotta get used to it. I'm, we're very low when it comes to elevation in Alaska, but up here in the mountains, it's pretty popping. We're we're up there. We're, yeah. we're up. Pretty high up. Pretty high up. <laughs> but yeah, the uh, it's harder to breathe, man. That's right. So it's lunchtime, and we went to go get some lobster mac and cheese down here at the mountain. Copper Mountain has been very, very generous to us. All these people, it's a Saturday, so it's popping, it's packed, but the run's been good. Lots of spawns here at this area. There's two gyms, so fun times if you're trying to, you know, stay in the gym, but the gyms are very active because they're, uh, so they, they just found out I'm, I'm doing this for YouTube, but you know, the Pokemon Go environment here. But there's two gyms. Is there Pokemon Go? Yeah, there's a lot of Pokemon here. Is it, is it like a rare Pokemon? Is there a rare one here there, yet? I just got one. Like they you got a rare one? Yes. What is it? Can you tell them? Um, What's the rare Pokemon? Okay, Do you want it a is... We get a lot of Bronco. What's that animal that we can get Bonita. 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 Yeah. We're Bonita. We got a shield on here. That's relatively rare. People have been chasing around town for it but it was here i didn't have to fight for it and there's this mac and cheese right here so <laughs> after you get tired of the mountain you can just go up hang out here and catch lure up boom it's it's great i i'm feeling this all right this is the you know 1000th run about to uh head down and see how these eggs have been hatching again this high altitude thing is really taking whew, a hit on me but we're gonna be good we're gonna go down we're going down 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah. i think that was the last one and we'll see what we did we got some friends opening gifts we got a legendary egg here and eggs hatching my 10ks are hatching all right this is good this is good oh my gosh <laughs> I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. <laughs> so, we cleared out. I was at 69 point something. Now I went to like 72.8. So, a good three something kilometers just on uh, the last time we checked at 1 p.m. ish. So, it's looking good. This is a very valid way to get some kilometers on your Pokemon Go app. Go snowboarding. Activity. Sports. I think we're gonna go try tru uh, tubing, tubing next. <laughs> oh, I'm not British. So to end the day, we are gonna go tubing. Tubing. You may step. Woo! Tubular. We got a tube pun. <laughs> we'll see you down there. <laughs> tubing. <laughs> 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 Tubular. <laughs> yes, yeah, so uh, day, 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 okay. day five, and just got some Denver Biscuit Company money. Money. It's so good, they even gave us stickers. Great. Great. Oh. I just asked for stickers, and they're like, we got stickers! But the, it was amazing. It was good. Uh, I feel like a 
really big person right now. My heart's bigger, probably pumping harder than it should, but that's, I just, that's the elevation. It's the elevation. Definitely <laughs> getting winded a lot faster here, but good place to work out, walk, have some biscuits. And there's two pokey stops, yeah! Okay, dreams come true. So we're in Wyoming at a gas station because we have no gas right now. And the dream is to get a Toros from every state, well, at least for me. And there, there one is at this gas station. And I'm gonna golden raspberry it because I want to search for it again so we can do other things here, such as take pictures in front of signs that say Cheyenne, Wyoming. Okay, threw a really bad ball at it, but golden raspberry should mitigate that totally. And there it is. Your boy souvenir. I don't have to buy shot glasses anymore or handkerchiefs or stuff like that. I got me a souvenir. Wyoming. She said, this is such a Wyoming place and I don't know what that means. What does that mean? It just feels like Wyoming. Feels like Wyoming. So we're going to roll with that and we're going to feel more Wyoming for a little bit. Yes. Okay. So Another gas station uh, blunder turned into a not so blunder. Caught a weather boosted Abra and it is perfect. perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Wyoming giveth. What, what? So it did not end up shiny, but we found a Palkia and it's windy. So we're going to try to duo it even after the HP buff. We're going to see how it goes as Draco Meteor. Turns out it's no good because we have received a Palkia with, what's that move? Draco. Draco Meteor. So it is not to be, but just want to give a shout out to, let me try to get a screenshot of this, but yeah. Uh, ooh, there's more chances if it stays weathery, but if you can see here, click, 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 click. There's a lot of Pokestops and gyms. It's not a dead zone for Pokemon Go for. Her. So Cheyenne players get at least something to do. Like this, better than I expected, but very, very nice. Can't wait to just go through and see if we can get another crack at this legendary, because <laughs> I'm sad about this right now, just a little bit. All right, adventure time. Over there, that is Cowgirls of the West Museum. We're in downtown Cheyenne, and it's it's classic. It's well, this is historic downtown Cheyenne. We're about to go to Nerd Shop, check out some magic cards, whatever. But you know, a little break of Pokemon. Feel better about our failed duo, but we're gonna try it one more again. So she made a really good point that it's so dead here. It's not because Wyoming is or Cheyenne has nothing going on. It's Super Bowl Sunday. No one is out. Womp womp womp. But it's really pretty. So I just say, hey, it's just dandy. But yeah, this historical district, the downtown district, is really nice. I'd love to walk around, but it's windy. Again, I'm in short sleeves, so I can't really say much. But I'm not that cold. But she is. So we're gonna be in the car. I'm gonna do my champ raid. Yeah. Sorry to say, but Anchorage. I mean, well, Cheyenne has a lot more going on Pokestop wise. Like, I would like this as my grind spot. Like, just good spawns. Look at that. It's pretty good. Rotate it, rotate it. Rotate. It's <laughs> rotating. But this is really good. I, I like this. And But there's a lot of one way streets here. So, it's got to be careful, be ready. But again, it is Super Bowl Sunday. So, I don't what think anyone's out. About? So we could just toy grind this till you know, ah. but you know, it's good stuff. We're gonna go do a Machamp raid, and is that what we're doing? Seven minutes left. We're gonna try. It's windy again. One more again. I'm gonna try one more again. <laughs> we won. <laughs> one thousand Stardust. Success. I hatched a Phoebus. <laughs> <laughs> hatched a Phoebus. <laughs> <laughs> little victories. Little victories. Winning. Okay, so we're in uh, Fort Collins right now. That's Colorado. Got finished with uh, Cheyenne, which is an exceptional place to play Pokemon. I would gladly do it again. We're in Fort Collins. I'm gonna say all that Pokemon is, is amazing. Not only it's it's really pretty. It's balling. We don't know where we're going, but we're gonna go for some mac and cheese and some Pokemon and trade because our 
collections are ridiculously full and no one's got time for that I hate playing having to delete five catching five seeing something that can be shiny <laughs> yeah and trade it will be but we're gonna go get some food i think this is this it it should be all right hopefully <laughs> copper smith's pub and brewery you know we're gonna go for that all right what are we looking for uh we're definitely here for mac and cheese and brewers favorite? mac and yes. cheese <laughs> money <laughs> Where there was once light, there is darkness. And that is Hope's Dash, because this place is closed because it's Super Bowl Sunday. Thought it would be good, but no. Can't escape it. Nope, it's <laughs> a thing. So, sports ball, you win today. You win today, sports ball. So that ends our Fort Collins adventure. Couldn't find mac and cheese, but we found another mac and cheese at an Irish pub, and that was good. We're gonna head back to Denver, and we'll see you tomorrow. What a parao. Breakfast, we just uh, finished breakfast at Jelly. Really good Benedict's, I'm a Benedict fiend. But yeah, we're gonna head to uh, walk around. Uh, got these cool Jelly stickers, there's a contest on it. Stick me someplace awesome. Take post picture and put a hashtag on it. The one bad thing about that place was we couldn't hit a Pokestop from it. We could see it, but we couldn't touch it. But if it was an Alaska radius circle, we would've been able to hit that Pokestop. But excellent decor, excellent food. The donuts were awesome. Speaking of donuts, uh, thinking about going to get more donuts, get more donuts <laughs> at Voodoo, and go down the sketch alley way right here. It's not that sketch, but check that out. <laughs> Art. <laughs> Where do they start? Here, boy. Portland. Let's see if this. <laughs> I don't know. This is, this is weird. See Colorado. Donuts that are like Portland donuts. I'm not trying to be snob about this, but the cool thing about this place is there's a gym right here, and I don't know exactly what it is. Voodoo Donut Man, how long has this been here? A long time. Okay, maybe I'm just not <laughs> hip with the new stuff, but Voodoo Donut Man, trying to get some donuts, it's cash only. But yeah, right here, we're gonna go get some donuts. Yeah, and gym. Hey, we're on Colfax Avenue. Just got our voodoo donuts, got the voodoo doll, she got the Colfax. Colfax cream. And it smells like essence of horse butt right now. I can't explain it, it's just wafting in the air. But if you can see over there, way over there, let me try to, over there, right next to there. That's the cash register uh, building and it's iconic Denver. And finally, finally got to see it. Thank you for making me look up. <laughs> but donuts are on point, I'm gonna go, uh, Go on a little adventure, get some gas, probably some boba tea. But yes, there was a gym here and we forgot to, we forgot to battle it because we are having so much fun picking out donuts. Woo! Oh, I, oh, I hate to do this, but yes, another one. Another one. Golden Raz. We're going. I still owe you one. It's the one I owe you one time. <laughs> Winning! Six or seven, we are at Trompeau, a French bakery. Apparently, we did not get here early enough, but there's a pokey stop here, which is great. And we're just having these ridiculous okay, um, no banana for scale, but here's my hand. These really big, okay, all right, the plus for scale. So, it's yeah, this is probably the size of like one of my like lobes in my brain and a quiche. So, getting well fed for the last day here in Denver, whatever day that is. And I'm just gonna let let the let the wind take me where it goes. That's the wind. <laughs> <laughs> Hope you get the metaphor, guys. <laughs> I'm about the metaphors. There it is, the cash register building. Register building. It's right there, right there. This is downtown Denver, and it looks like it would be a cluster. A uh, word to try to raid here, but definitely a nice place to get your Pokestops. If you want to get fine little souvenirs to send to your friends, definitely this would be a good spot. It's nice and dense, like lead. It's very dense, but and a lot of pretty things and a lot of really high things. I was telling Nicole that 
We have not as many tall buildings in Alaska, you know, earthquake stuff. And there's just not a need for such ridiculousness over here. <clears throat> buildings on buildings on buildings. I can't even get to the top of that one, but it's nice to be somewhere different, you know, for a little bit, even though I'm going back home soon. <laughs> There's no way to be smooth out that one. Okay. Hi. So we're at 16th, uh, what is this called? 16th, 16th Street, Street Mall. Mall. And even though I'm drifting because of all the buildings, there's a spot where you can hit like a Starbucks and three other Pokestops. So it's four thingamajiggies. It's right there. But, you know, drift is telling me I'm not there. So we're gonna roll with that amazing little spot. We're gonna go walk up and down, hopefully not get hit by anything. It's gonna be a good time. The last hurrah for Denver, but, you know, oh yeah, you never say last. Uh, this is the 1,000th run. I don't know. There's a superstition when it comes to like snowboarding. You never say the last run. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. <laughs> she might not have 100 million experience, but she has a PhD, guys. She has a PhD. <laughs> Which is probably why I don't have 100 million experience. <laughs> well, to be fair, uh, you know, that's an easy trade for me. Again, to a good day is Queen in the background and the cash register building. Iconic, yeah! But so far, 16th Street Mall has been very, very good. Uh, our shiny hunt has not been fruitful, but it's still good. It's still a nice place to walk. A lot of restaurants, uh, Krispy Kreme, a whole lot of corporate things, but, but, you know, sometimes if you need a fix, you got your fix right here. You know, right here. A lot of good walking. I'm about the walking life. I don't know if you're about, like, driving. I'm not going to, like, you know, judge or anything. But I really like playing this game while on foot. Or a bike, skateboard. It's just the explorer in me is happy to be outside, breathing the air. If you ever do come to Colorado, there's definitely a Colorado Fresh, if you know what I mean. But still fun times. You're out there in the air and you're surrounded by buildings. You don't really have this in Anchorage, Alaska. Uh, our tallest building is not taller than that one right there. So, you know, I'm just a small town girl living in a lonely world. We'll just keep this grind on until we get a shiny or I gotta go to the airport. <sighs> your boy just hatched the Bonsley. It's your boy on 16th Street. Okay, so that was the last point I'm probably going to click here on 16th and that brings this trip to a wrap. I'm going to leave that spoink in the pocket. No, I'm going to escape. <clears throat> Whatever. But Denver has been, Denver, Colorado, Wyoming has been an excellent trip. Got to say thank you to Hideaki for taking us around, getting some uh, legendary raids in a little tin. Fun little raid group, you know. Um, my accidental host, uh, Nicole, uh, did not expect that. She was like, uh, I guess. So I'll take it. And yeah, just Denver for being a very fresh city. Like when you're away from the actual Colorado air and some real fresh Colorado air, it's very refreshing. And I'd like to say that that high altitude does get to you. When you exert yourself, watch yourself. So here from Denver, peace and out back to Alaska. You're only traveling YouTuber from Alaska. <laughs> I would say like, you know, whatever. But anyway, see you next Rantar. Be excellent. Mwah.